Hey everybody, Jeff Smith here from InfomarketerZone.com. That's InfomarketerZone.com. Glad to have you with us today. I'm going to go through in a couple minutes and address the number one question that I get from people that want to start their own businesses online on the internet and they, they ideally want to maybe write their own information based product or they want to get into information marketing. That means writing and marketing their own ebooks or they want to get into um, developing reports or a private membership site. Um, some sort of training or coaching program, seminars, teleseminars, those are all information delivery type businesses. Some people are coming from a, a, a point of view where they have some sort of consulting or information background offline. You know, they're already trainers or speakers, things like that. Some people just have, you know, want a complete change of career. Um, but it's a different animal. When you go online, um, you've got so many more resources at your fingertips to be able to understand what people want and what people are spending money in. And believe me, they're spending billions and billions of dollars on information on the Internet. So this is a highly lucrative product. Now, the one really cool part about getting into this business is that when people are buying information, they're buying solutions to problems. They're buying, um, a, a, basically, they're, they're buying a system that gets them results to solve a problem they have or fulfill a desire that they have. And they're not really buying the expertise. They don't really care if, you're, uh, if you've got the credentials to, to back up what you're saying. What they really want to know is they want to know that your system addresses their problem. The first thing they really want to know is, okay, I've got a problem, I'm jumping online, I'm searching somewhere, and I really need to know, you know, if I come across your website um, or your blog or your, you know, your product somewhere, I need to know that it addresses my problem. So the very first thing, if you think about it, that's going to make you successful online, the most impactful thing you can do is find and make sure you're tuned in to a specific niche problem online. And that's what we're going to cover in this real quick video. I, I'm up at a site called clickbank.com forward slash marketplace. Now this is Clickbank's marketplace. This is where tens of thousands of information products are sold. Clickbank, uh, you know, they're real good to us. They, they share a ton of information with us uh, in these categories you see off to the left. They allow us to search for different products. But what's really cool is they, they actually categorize them as to what's most popular and what is actually selling the best at this point in time. So I want to go into a category that's you know, pretty busy. The people kind of shy away from because they think, ah, oh, it's too competitive. I can't compete. I don't have the credentials. You know, yada yada. But it, it really, you know, there are still people entering this market today. Um, you know, that have never done this before. That are making, you know, literally millions of dollars on information marketing. Every year, there's a new products that are launched in this area uh, that end up to be million dollar products. So. Let's actually go through the category, and first thing you notice when you go into any of these categories, and you can come, you can go and search this anytime you want, um, is that they're by default sorted by something called popularity, which just means over a period of time, over the last 30 days, how are these products selling? These are the ones that are selling the most. Now, important to to understand is these aren't just theoretical products that focus on health and fitness. These aren't your your books that you'll find in the bookstore. What makes these top sellers at anywhere from 20 to 40 to you'll see some of them into the hundreds of dollars and they're selling literally millions of dollars worth of these information products is we're going to hone in on a few of them to understand that they address specific problems. And so that's, that's the lesson really in this video today is that you need to focus, if you're talking about niche, nicheifying or, or coming up with a niche that you want to focus your information product on, think of that as a problem that someone has that they're going to jump online today and actually try and solve or a, um, a, a desire they have to be something, go do something, um, y you know, become someone that they're not. And so your product needs to address that, that dream, that desire, or that, um, that real burning issue that they have to solve a problem. And so let's look at some of these and what problem or what desire they're, they're tapping into. The diet solution program. So if we actually open this, and I'm not going to go through every one of these because I want to keep this short, but... Basically, if you go into this one, um, the promise is natural weight loss, and um, it's actually a different marketing approach. It's actually videos and a lot of proof that's behind it. So this is mainly a marketing exercise, um, but it's really focused on burning away fat. So let's go into the second one, truth about abs. Now, think about this. Instead of just a generic weight loss product, this one actually goes in and talks about abdominals, a very specific part of the body. So think about that within whatever niche you're in. If you can drill down to one level detail lower and sub-niche your market, then think about it. If somebody's coming in and they really are trying to find 
you know, their abdominals are what they're really concerned with. That's what they have in their head. I want abs of steel. I want to look in the mirror and see my abs, right? Um, then that's what they're going to go online. And if this message hits them, wham, what do you think is more popular, this message or just a general weight loss message? Well, of course, it's this one, right? So think about those sorts of things. The second one, uh, sorry, the third one, fat burning furnace. Now, what's cool about this is if you think about weight loss, a lot of a lot of you'll find that a lot of people are really looking to burn fat and and the connotation there i think is that it just kind of melts off you but it's not so much work i mean the number one problem people have with weight loss programs is either their diets that they can't follow or they're painful or they have to go out and exercise a whole lot and that's painful you know it's a painful process that it doesn't have a, you know a greater than 50 percent chance of success so why even bother right so if you can come up with products that that uh, kind of denote that it's it's an easier, simpler method that's quicker, that it requires less effort, and that's what this whole term fat burning, and then add furnace to it, and it's almost like it just operates automatically and the fat melts off you. So, you know, targeting that very specific issue within a very mature market that you need easier, simpler, less painful ways to burn fat. Let's see what else is in here. Um, bum -bum. Uh, extreme fat loss. Okay, let's go. This one focuses here. You'll see no nonsense muscle building, six pack abs, right? So the focus here is on building muscle while you burn fat, and that, that again appeals to a certain sub niche within the weight loss um, group of people. Let's see, burn the fat, feed the muscle. That's focusing on that sort of sub niche. Let's go to the next page, and you can go about five or six pages deep in a lot of these, and still find very popular, high performing products. Um, in another video, we'll go through a little bit more about what the numbers mean uh, against each of these. But right now, just search based on uh, popularity. Here's one here, uh, vertical jump training. So again, there's, there's a group of interested people that are understanding that there's some health advantages to vertical jump. Um, th that is, and, and basically, this I is appealing to anyone who's in sports. So volleyball, football, basketball, being able to, to get vertical jump. Again, very sub-niche within that... Um, within that market segment. Now look at total sale average is $55. Average sales $45. These are not like $20 books, right? These are, these are pretty hefty information pro pro uh, programs. So again, this one is obviously uh, last longer, increase your stamina for bed. That's certainly a sub niche. Um, we've got, then we've got a whole bunch of conditions. You've got hemorrhoids, you've got yeast infections, you've got tinnitus. These are top selling sites. And again, they're, they're focused on very real problems. So I'll leave you with that. Just think about your niche and think about what specific problems you can solve. And if you've already got an information product, then you should be, if it's not selling, then chances are you're not focused on one of those sub niches. So just transition a little bit, tweak it, make it, uh, you know, appeal to some of those sub niches and you'll have a winning product. These products folks are selling between half a million to a million dollars worth a year of these eBooks of 25 to $50 eBooks. And they've all got back ends to them as well. So very exciting business. If you want to know more about the business, incidentally, head over to infomarketerzone.com. That's infomarketerzone.com. We've got tons of video tutorials. Uh, we've been in this business. We have um, dozens of information products ourselves online. In fact, we've looked at a couple of them here. And so um, head over to the site. We'll, we'll get you um, filled in on this exciting business and give you some training. And there's some free, um, free videos and things over there as well. So head over to infomarketerzone.com. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye for now.